I'm greatly concerned about it being right next to my eyeball. It's vegan. I don't care if it's vegan <laughs> if I'm blind. Yeah. I used to do a lot of eyeliner when I was a teenager, when I was a grunger. I used to think I was in Green Day. Sadly wasn't. This is very exciting. We are testing today Kat Von D Lash Liner. And it's the Inner Liquid Eyeliner. Inner Liquid Liner. Ooh. Inner eye is a worry. Apparently this is the first ever, I think, liquid eyeliner for your waterline. It's vegan, so that's very good. So that's what I can get from the box. It's in Trooper Black, which is cool. I used to do a lot of eyeliner when I was a teenager, when I was a grunger. I used to think I was in Green Day. Sadly wasn't. I'm worried about looking like an emo when it's not cool to be an emo anymore. I've never ever worn eyeliner under my eye ever. Not even a little smudge, nothing. It just looks weird on me. I think what's gonna happen is that I'm gonna put it in and my whole eye is gonna turn black, like that guy that tattooed his eyeballs. Ooh. Oh, so basically this is gonna go in this bit here. Great. Yeah. I was expecting like a brush, kind of like, uh, like a proper liquid eyeliner, but it's basically just what I can assume is a cotton bud covered in black. So that's good. This is the weirdest brush I've ever seen. Oh, it's a lot thicker than I thought it was going to be. I hope we've got an eye bath nearby. All right, I suppose we're just going to go in. It's really not a natural thing to go at your eye with something this massive. Well, not for me anyway. Okay, so I'll just start over here. Yeah. Okay, right, ready? Oh god. Oh wow, it's it's like pen. Oh, it doesn't feel bad. Oh no, I've got it in my eye, on my eyeball. It's going in my eye. Don't worry about the fact that my eye's watering. I'm sure that happens to everybody. Do not be concerned. It feels quite good. It's going on quite well, but it's a bit patchy. <laughs> I'm greatly concerned about it being right next to my eyeball. Vegan. I don't care if it's vegan if I'm <laughs> blind. It's like paint. Oh. Oh. What you don't want is directly in your eye. That's pro probably bad for you. Oh dear. One thing I would say is that it's quite a lot of it comes off on the brush. It's black, it's really black. But my eye is really watering. It feels like it will stay for a long time and it's not coming off on my eyes, which is good. It's just hard for me to get past the fact that I don't normally wear eyeliner under my eyes and that's not Kat Von D's fault, is it? Let's not have a go for that. That's pretty impressive. Because um, normally you think that would immediately transfer underneath, but it hasn't. Um, <sighs> that was a lot. If you get tearful, funny eyes like me, then maybe give it a minute before you step outside into the wind. I think if you do normally wear eyeliner underneath your eyes, then this is probably a great piece of kit. But uh, until I start doing that, it's probably a no for me. I'm actually really impressed by this. I was terrified throughout the whole thing, but the fact that it hasn't smudged and it's really black, um, I feel like it looks kind of cool. That was a lot less painful than I thought it was going to be, <laughs> apart from when it got into my eye. I would definitely say if you're someone that just doesn't love putting eye makeup on, this is something that you should get.